This video describes the External File Reference Manager for importing external references from Pack and Save files into your data folders. Pack and Save files are great for portability since they collect all of an Esprit file's external references, such as machines, fixtures, and tool holders, in a single zip file. When you open a Pack and Save file, the new External File Reference Manager simplifies the task of importing those external references into the appropriate file libraries. To get started, we open a Pack and Save Esprit file. Esprit prompts you to import the Pack and Save references into your libraries. If you choose No, Esprit immediately opens the file, keeping and using all of the references from the Pack and Save. When you choose Yes, Esprit compares the machine, holder, and fixture files from the Pack and Save file with those in your Esprit file libraries, then displays the results in the External References Manager. The External References Manager lists all of the Pack and Save references with an icon representing their file type, machine, fixture, or holder, the file name, search status, available actions, and file path. For each reference, review the search status and decide on the action to take. Then, depending on the action you choose, you may also need to select or browse for a replacement file. You can click the Type, File Name, and Status column headers to sort the list by those categories. The search status indicates whether the reference already exists in your library. The found status indicates that it's pre-found the file in the relevant file library folder. The not found status indicates that Esprit could not find the file in your library. The conflicting status indicates that Esprit found multiple instances or a different instance of the file in the relevant library. The conflict icon appears in the file path column. Now, for each reference, choose one of the three possible actions in the actions column. The replace with action replaces the file in your default library with the file from the pack and save file. The copy to action copies the file from the pack and save file to your library. If the file already exists in your library, Esprit saves a backup copy of the original file with the extension .bak. The keep action keeps and uses the file from the pack and save in the default unpacked Esprit files folder. This location is specified in options. Note that you can select multiple items from the list with Ctrl A to select all, or hold Ctrl or Shift and click to select multiple individual items or a range of items. Then, if you click the down arrow in the action column header and select an action from the drop down menu, you apply that action to all selected items. Let's look at some examples with our file. We'll start with the conflicting files. We sort them by status to get conflicting files and not found files at the top of the list. The first conflicting file is a jaw. When we click on the arrow next to the conflict icon, notice that we have the reference in the library, but it is different from the file that came in the pack and save. Instead of replacing the reference, which is the manager's default suggestion, we'll set the action to copy to and make a copy of the reference. We also want to set a new name for the copy, so we click on the folder icon to create a new folder, rename the file, and click Save. In the External Reference Manager, a preview of the new file path is displayed. Note that we have not yet created this file copy. Esprit will carry out all of our specified actions when we click OK. The machine reference also displays a conflict status. When we click on the arrow, we see that we already have several instances of the reference inside the library. We can see which file is identical to the pack and save reference and which file is different although they have the same file name. We'll keep the default replace with action and choose one of the identical machines. We'll choose the file in the machine three folder. Esprit did not find the next three references in our library, so the default action is set to copy to. Esprit will copy these files to the library. If we don't want to copy them to the library, we set the action to keep. Esprit will use the reference from the pack and save. We can also choose the Replace With option if we don't want to copy a reference to the library and instead want to use a different reference from the library. In this case, we need to browse for the replacement file. The rest of the references all have the found status, which means that we already have them in our library and Esprit will automatically use them to open the document. You can use the Reset to Default button at the lower left corner of the manager to return all actions and file path selections to the manager's default settings. Click Cancel or Close the Manager to stop the import and stop opening the Esprit document. Now that we have selected and verified all of the file actions, we click OK to open the file. Esprit carries out the selected actions and opens the file using the reference files we chose. 
To summarize, the File Reference Manager makes it easy to import and update referenced files from Pack and Save files into your file library. This prevents missing references and helps keep references consistent from computer to computer. Thank you for watching this Esprit product feature video. For more information about this and other new features in Esprit, refer to the Release Bulletin and Product Help.